like racing. And Naira Bets lets you place your bets and watch the races live from anywhere. Make easy, secure deposits and play promotions every day to earn reward points or cash. Download the Naira Bets app or visit NairaBets.com. home like racing and naira bets lets you place your bets and watch the races live from anywhere make easy secure deposits and play promotions every day to earn reward points or cash download the naira bets app or visit nairabets.com Series, the Blues and the Raptors. Carson Wentz got a major payday. Dominic team ends Djokovic's 26 match Grand Slam winning streak. Whew, man, my brain in overload right now. I'm your host, Lauren. He started fighting. Yes, he bit it. He only lost a chunk of his ear, but he wanted to keep fighting. That's the bad man. He bit his ear. 52,605 of you. Of course, he knew that. 750 of you thought he wet willy did it. That's probably a great technique now. Anyway, before we move on to round two, you can use multiple extra lives per game, all the way up to three of them. But here's the catch. You can only buy one per game. You buy them all once per game. So stock up now before it's too late. And then, you know, you have to take your ball and go home. It's simple, but never on the final round. All right, round two, here we go. NFL formation typically involves having football the greatest distance. John Gunn, punt, or field goal. Who's ready for some football? I know I am. Well, shotgun sends a quarterback five to seven yards behind the center. Field goal, field goal formation is typically seven yards back. But by far the longest is the punt, where the long snapper fires the ball 15 yards back. Punt is your answer here at round two. 27,218 of you getting that one right. Wow, over 17,000. Thought it was a shotgun. Wow. All right, I know you're ready for football. Football and basketball always results in the opposing team getting a free throw of 10 seconds, charging or double dribble. Anyone else think the Raptors would be up 3 1 before game 4? I sugar honey iced tea did not think so myself. Charting is an offensive foul, and double dribble is an offensive violation, both of which result in a change of possession. But defensive three seconds is a technical foul, given the other team a free throw and the ball. Defensive three seconds, 15,908 of you getting this one. Wow! We got a TKO here at round number three. Bam! I'm going to call it here because it's round three. Come on! 15,908 of you are still in the ring. Let's go. The first we had your extra lives ready. All right, this guy, arguably the greatest kicker of all time, is known more for his accuracy than his length. Sure, kick. Take a look. And it's a floater. Could have been eaten by Hester. Here he goes. It's Hester. Inside the 30. That was kicked by the goat and then taken 92 yards to the house by the goat of kick returns to Devin Hester. Adam Vinatieri is the 
the one we're talking about. 22,282 of you getting that one. Player in the World Series era to hit 20 home runs is Team Frank Schulte, Ty Cobb, Babe Ruth. All right, fun side game. How about you name the players that hit 20 already this season? I'll give you a hint. They're all in the National League, unless Gary Sanchez just got subbed in for the Yankees right now because he didn't start. Anyway, back to this question. The first to hit 60 home runs was the Babe, but the first to hit 50? Also the baby. 40, the great Bambino. But 20, Frank Schulte got there first in 1911 for the Chicago Cubs. Frank Schulte is your answer. 7,184. Whoa! Another TKO here at round number five. Damn! Ooh, that one hurt. Hey, it was just a TKO. At least I didn't take a piece of your ear, okay? You could still use an extra life and get back in the game because we are almost halfway there. It's round six. Let's do it. What college score uses an 80-second shot clock? Lacrosse hockey or field hockey? An 80-second shot clock. We only use a 10. Get that answer in. All right, basketball used to have no shot clock at all. But after Dean Smith and the four quarters bored everyone to death, it was implemented and is now 30 seconds. Lacrosse added the more leisurely 80-second shot clock just last year. Lacrosse is your answer, 16,834 of you getting that one right. We got a shout out to our lacrosse champs of 2019, Virginia and Maryland, men's and women's respectively. All right, round seven coming at you. The winner of this year's UEFA Champions League came from the top soccer division in what nation? Spain, Germany, England. We're looking for the nation. Well, the Champions League is called that because it features champions as well as near champions from leagues all across Europe. This year's Champions League final saw two teams from England face off as Liverpool defeated Tottenham 2-0. England is your answer here, 15,397 of you getting that one right and you made it past the seventh round. You know what that means. It's time for the seventh round stretch. Here we go. I got this question to ask. Are you watching the Women's World Cup? Come on, we're just talking about soccer. Are you watching the Women's World Cup? You love it. You're watching it all. Yes, you watch what you can. Or no, 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 it's not my thing. I want to hear your answer right now. Women's World Cup just kicked off. I want to see who's watching. What did you have to say? Oh, wow. Not the answer I was expecting. Island on Tuesday. In the meantime, round eight, here it is. The top pick in this year's MLB draft plays what position? Short stop, catcher, or pitcher. Make your selection. This was one of those years in baseball where everyone knew who the top pick would be before the draft even started. Oregon State catcher Adley Rochman, who is now a Baltimore Oriole. Take a look at him, making everyone proud. He is indeed a catcher. Catcher is the answer to our toughest questions. Can you hang on for a win? Round number nine. What tennis player spent most weeks as the sport's number one female athlete in the first decade of the 2000s? It's Ray Williams, Justine Ennett, or Lindsay Davenport. In the 2010s, no one is close to Serena, whose 236 weeks at number one are more than three times that of her nearest competitor. But in the 2000s, Serena's 83 weeks at number one was 